Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Michaela, and today, as you can tell from the title of this video, I'm doing a Princess Polly try on haul. I'm super excited because I, as you know, love Princess Polly. It's one of my favorite brands, especially for curvy women. Um, I'm a size US 6 to 10. I find it really hard sometimes to find pieces and you know brands that actually carry stuff that fits curvy women and so princess Polly is one of those brands for me and i absolutely love them so i feel like this is just such an organic fit into my channel um, i'm going to be talking about each piece and then i will be trying it on on camera as well i'm really excited to get into spring fashion i don't know what it is um this winter i was just so like I don't know, I wasn't inspired by fashion. I was getting kind of bored with winter, so I'm really excited for spring and summer fashion. And also, really exciting, I do have a code with Princess Polly. It's XOMichaela20 for 20% off your order. So I will leave it up on the screen the whole entire time so that you can use it if you want to pause and buy a piece. You can use my code for 20% off. So when I was choosing pieces for this haul, I really wanted to focus on incorporating my own style and not kind of steering away from the trends. I feel like last year I really followed a lot of trends and even if they weren't necessarily my style. So I really went for more classic pieces that were a little bit more fun, but things that I would wear not just in spring and summer and that I would wear for years to come. So that is what I was going for with these pieces. They might not necessarily be colorful enough or springy enough for you, but my style is very neutral. So that's what I went with with these pieces today. So I'm excited to get started and show you guys some of the pieces that I got and styled them for you. Okay, so for the first piece, I'm actually wearing this top. I bought this last summer, maybe last fall. And it's this white ribbed crop top. I love this item. I think this is like the perfect basic to get. Obviously it's white. It goes with pretty much everything. I've gotten a lot of wear out of it. This is a size US 10, I wanna say. I did size up just to have it not be as tight so that I could wear a bra underneath of it without it showing through. This is such a good top. It's very high quality and so it's really versatile for you know every season. So I didn't necessarily buy it for spring but I did want to include it in this haul because I will be wearing it for spring. So the next pair of pants that I wanted to include are the Archer pants. I love these pants so much. I actually bought these along with this top at around the same time and I fell in love with them and I will definitely be wearing these for spring and summer. I think that these are such a good staple piece to have Again, I really wanted to buy and invest in basics for my closet and things that I know I can wear with multiple things and in multiple seasons. So this whole outfit, you will see me wearing this fall, winter, summer, whatever. They actually fit so well and I would recommend these for any curvy girl. They're just so flattering. They sit really high-waisted. They sit about an inch and a half to two inches above your belly button. So they're super high-waisted and they accentuate your waist and snatch you in. Um, and then they also have enough room for your hips and your thighs. And they're wide leg pants, so they are really, really flattering for larger thighs. I really love these pants. I, they go with anything. You can dress them up, you can dress them down. But yeah, I just love these pants so much and I decided to include them today. First thing off the rack is this set. It's a big beige ribbed set um, and it comes with a crop top and a skirt it's like a maxi skirt i freaking love this set you guys it's so flattering i got it in a us 8 and it fits so well it snatches you but it doesn't accentuate your you know stomach or anything like that it's not super tight to where it's unflattering i think that the rib material is like thick enough where it's not see-through um, and it actually snatches you in and i just really love it i think this is going to be a perfect uh piece or perfect set for spring it's going to be really nice to wear to like brunch or something like that i love how comfortable it is i also love the beige color of course it's very neutral so you can kind of like add pops of color to it like if you wanted to wear a bright color heel or wear a bright color bag to accessorize it and make it more of a spring look you totally could do that but i just love the color of it it's very flattering and again it's also a set so you can honestly wear both of these separate which i really like i that's why i love to get sets of clothes because you can wear each piece multiple times with different outfits and interchange them so you don't necessarily have to wear these together but i do love them and they're really soft flattering and 
honestly one of my favorite pieces that I got in this haul. This next top is so fun, but it's also a neutral. It's a brown sparkly mesh long sleeve top. I just think when you're doing neutrals, it's really important to add a little bit of fun in through like sparkles or patterns and things like that. So that's why I gravitated towards this top. I just think it is such a cute piece and it's super fun and it's lightweight. I love the mesh material. It's very thin, so it's not going to be too heavy, too thick for spring as it starts to get hot. Um, so this could be a really cute cover up. You could wear it by itself. I would wear like a black bralette under this. It kind of gives me like Y2K vibes. Speaking of Y2K and fun prints, this mini skirt, this is like a zebra abstract print and it's brown, neutral of course. So flattering, it's very stretchy. It's a nice soft mesh material. Um, it does have a slip underneath so it's not see-through or anything, but I wanted a way to incorporate some fun prints without it being too out of the box, too colorful or anything like that. I just think it's such a fun piece for spring. I'm super excited to wear this out really never wear mini skirts because I'm just not really a skirt kind of girl um, in the first place but just because all the mini skirts that I've ever tried on just like ride up really fast and this one actually fits really nice it's flattering but it's still breathable and you can move around in it walk around in it without it riding up so I'm really excited to wear this out this spring sticking with the animal print theme I got this zebra print mesh crop top Oh my gosh. I think this is pretty self-explanatory. I really wanted, uh, again, to incorporate some fun prints. I think prints are gonna be all the rage this spring. Um, and I wanted to just incorporate it in a neutral way, which this is just plain black and white. And I think this is just a fun pop. You can wear this with color. You can kind of make it like a huge statement or you can make it understated and maybe have this be the statement piece. And I've never really done animal print because I always thought it was super tacky in a way um, and I feel like this is a way to do it that's a little bit more classy and less um, in your face kind of gives me vacation vibes and I actually have another skirt that I wanted to show you guys um, and this is kind of the vision that I had when I got these pieces is to style them together for a vacation look so I also got this maxi skirt um, in this really pretty lime jade like a jungle green it's like really vibrant this material is so soft you guys like so soft and i wanted to get like a maxi skirt just to go out of my comfort zone a little bit i nor don't normally wear skirts like i said it kind of gives me miami vibes is what i was going for super fun still kind of a neutral like i could really wear this with a neutral top and it would still be a neutral but it's still a pop of color if you know what i'm saying with the zebra print top i thought that was going to be such a cute vacation vibe like imagine wearing this in like cabo or um, i'm going to greece this summer so maybe even greece for a pop of color that would just be such a fun look without going too crazy um but yeah i really like this one it's super flattering my butt looks so good in it and i'm just really excited about this piece this next top is just a basic crop top and it's very similar to the one that i'm wearing right now but it is in this like olive green tone like a khaki green almost i obviously loved this top already and so i wanted to get one in a color but i wanted to keep it neutral and i love the color green it goes well with my eyes and my hair and it's really flattering to my skin tone as well so i always gravitate towards the color green when i'm shopping for clothes it's just i'm drawn by it obviously i have that like bright green skirt so i wanted something that was a little bit more subdued that i could wear in the fall and spring any well pretty much any season so that is what i went for with this one um this one's really flattering it's a really good size it has a lot of coverage so it's not going to cut in too far it kind of fits similar to this one so it's a thicker material and it's just a really good quality top so i definitely recommend getting your basics from princess polly i really love they're basics. The last two items, I ended up getting a couple of dresses. Now, especially more than ever, everyone's gonna be leaving the house and going out and having fun, especially with spring and warmer weather rolling around. So I wanted a couple of going out dresses. Maybe this would be cute for date night, hint, hint, 
Sean, I feel like you could really dress this up or down too. And this is such a flattering dress. So it's this green olive tone ruched mini dress. It actually has padding in the boobs. So it's really nice. So you don't have to wear a bra with it and it won't, you know, show anything there. It is really flattering because of the ruched detail. And yeah, I just really loved the color of this dress. It really drew my eye and it was just a little bit more different than your typical like LBD. And last but not least, I have the satin shirt dress. This is just such a staple. I have actually had this in my shopping cart for quite some time now because I have had my eye on this style for so long. I see it all over Instagram and it has just been really popular lately. I feel like with spring rolling around and warmer weather, this is gonna be such a staple piece. I love just like the plain black. You can dress it up or down. I feel like with a bright colored heel or a bright colored bag, it would be such a vibe and it would look so cute for the spring or summer. And yeah, I really love this top. I've had my eye on it for a while now and I'm super excited to be able to style it this spring. All right, you guys, and that completes this Princess Polly spring haul. Like I said before, I'm super excited about spring fashion. I'm really inspired and like just ready to style these pieces and incorporate some color and really kind of like finding out my style this year. I really want to elevate my closet a little bit and really focus on curating my own style and i feel like with these pieces this is exactly what i'm trying to go for the vision that i had with these pieces was to do exactly that and i feel like i nailed it so i'm really excited about these pieces and just want to remind you again that i do have a 20 percent off code with princess polly if you're interested in any of these pieces they will be linked down below the code is xo michaela 20 it is only valid for one month uh, from the date of posting this video so make sure to run over to princess polly to get these pieces before they're sold out or before the code runs out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.